And sing a tale of tragic times When leaders lost their heads And of strange mysterious hangings That fill my heart with dread It was a time of revolution With great leaders cast aside If you listen to me carefully In you I will confide so where have all the masters gone? We're all asking Why have all their portraits gone? We'd like to know Where have all the masters gone? The hanging committee took everyone Oh, when will they return? When will they ever return? We heard when they removed them, it was only for a trial, and we'd all be asked our verdicts in just a little while. But the Large Hadron Collider and probes to outer space all yield their answers earlier than this trial's sluggish pace. The hall's awful acoustics would surely be improved by five absorbent canvases like those that they've removed. But I find it rather hard to think as I watch this empty space that naked bricks look better than each master's smiling face. So where have all the masters gone? We're all asking why have all their portraits gone? We'd like to know Where have all the masters gone? The hanging committee took everyone Oh, when will they return? When will they ever return? The committee's picture hanging trial Has been stretched out so long that to remind us that it's just a trial, I wrote this crazy song. <laughs> so at Michael Caine's immortal words, I urge them not to scoff. You were only supposed to hang them, not blow their blasted heads off. <laughs> so where have all the masters gone? We're all asking. Why have all their portraits gone? We'd like to know. Why have all the masters gone? The hanging committee took everyone. Oh, when will they return? When will they ever return? that um, arose in an article on the internet. And it's a web article about things that children have written in history and English lessons at school. Um, so I took the punchlines from the things that they'd actually written and constructed a verse around each punchline, and this is the result. From the mouths of babes and sucklings Many pearls of wisdom fall, and I'm glad to say a school teacher has tried to catch them all. And the verses of this song I'll sing obey one simple rule. They're based on things the children wrote in history class at school. Now the mummies lived long times ago, and Egypt was their nation. They cultivated deserts by using irritation. <laughs> and the ancient Greek philosophers of history were the bedrock, but Socrates, he met his end.
by an overdose of, we of wedlock. <laughs> the next lot was called Romans in verses, books, and songs because they never stayed around in one place very long. Henry VIII was a very big man, a famous king in history. The reason he found walking hard was an abbess on his knee. When Elizabeth the first was queen, they thought that she'd go far. She exposed herself before her troops, and they all shouted, hurrah. John Milton was a writer. For Paradise Lost he's famed, but then one day his wife died, he wrote Paradise Regained. <laughs> Newton was the scientist, he invented gravity, there's more of it in autumn, so the apples fall from trees. <laughs> Pasteur found a cure for rabbis and other strange diseases, Charles Darwin was a naturist who wrote the organ of the species. <laughs> and finally, Sir Francis Drake, that well-known sailing skipper, he circumcised the whole wide world with a hundred-foot-long clipper. 